Drama unfolded along the busy Mombasa Malindi Highway as NTSA officials conducted a random alcohol blow test to confirm if those behind the wheels were not under the influence of alcohol. Please. My God. Some being too sure of spending the night in custody and spoiling their Christmas mood decided to take on their heels, leaving behind their cars. Over 10 drivers were apprehended with NTSA Deputy Director in Charge of Operations and Safety Enforcement, Harad Adan, promising to continue with the exercise in a bid to sanitize the roads during the festive season. In Thika town, NTSA officials made an impromptu visit to some of the Matatu circles to ascertain the status of the Matatus ferrying passengers up country for the festive season. A number of the PSVs were found to be defective, with NTSA Thika regional manager Joseph Parteroi calling on the operators to observe traffic rules following a series of fatal accidents that have claimed the lives of over 180 people in three weeks. Thika Deputy County Commissioner Tom Ajere, who accompanied the team, assured residents that security had been beefed up within the town, promising to enhance police patrols to allow Thika residents enjoy their Christmas holiday. In Meru County, base commander Vincent Okoth has warned drivers against drunk driving, overlapping and obstruction, which are the leading cause of traffic jams and accidents in Meru town. Yeshimu sheria, fuata sheria, ili uzuwilie hiyo mabaya isitokee kiti ya kwanza ni hii usiendeshe gari kwa spidi ya juu enda kwa spidi ile umepewa kulingana na gari yako kiti ya pili ingawaje unakuja kwa christmas ama ni wakati ya christmas Ukiwa unajua umekunywa pombe naomba usiendeshe gari Usiendeshe gari kama lazima ustembee peana usaidiwe uletwe nyumbani upreke mali unaenda na ufike salama But in Kitui Mwingi West member of parliament Charles Nguna was reading from a different script blaming corrupt traffic police and NTSA officers for the increased cases of road carnage one of the main reasons why we are witnessing a lot of accidents is the corruption in policemen, especially the traffic policemen. We've witnessed a lot of lorries actually without number plates in Mwinki West being driven along the highways and policemen are not doing enough uh, to ensure proper rules and regulations of the road are followed. I would like to condemn what is happening the corruption of high order in our highways and roads. The legislator says PSV operators have continued breaking traffic laws under the watchful eyes of traffic police and NTSA. He made the remarks at Katoteni village in Mwingi West during the burial of the driver of the Kinato Sako Matatu, which was involved in an accident that killed more than 16 people along Thika Garissa Highway a week ago. Reporting for Channel One Weekend, I'm Ron Cliff, OD.